Africa Teen Geeks is a non-profit organization that teaches um, children aged 9 to 18 from disadvantaged communities how to code. Only 5% of our schools teach IT and um, also only from grade 10 to 12 and those schools are mainly in affluent areas. So the majority of, of kids from, from disadvantaged communities may never ha ever have an opportunity to learn you know, how to code. One of the biggest challenges that we face is, you know, we, when I started Africa Teen Geeks, I was very excited at the beginning because we had the University of South Africa, UNISA, supporting us by providing their labs on Saturdays and also um, in June and um, December where we can bring kids to come for an entire week to learn how to code. Um, the biggest surprise was you go, you tell the parents, we had the, you know, we had the support of the media, you promote it and you go to the labs and kids don't, are not there. And, um, and I think for me was realizing that providing an opportunity for a lot of uh, kids in the township is, is, you know, is not enough because accessing that opportunity is still a challenge. And uh, what we found was that the kids wanted to come but they didn't afford the money to for taxis to come to the labs, it, you know, the UNISA labs which were, were in town. My biggest success is really seeing our kids coming. Most of them have never touched a computer before. And, um, and at the end of the day, seeing them creating their first apps and their first programs. And, and you know, now we're taking a couple of our kids to, um, to Silicon Valley where they'll get an opportunity to, you know, um, be exposed to the heart or the home of technology and getting them to actually compete at an international level. You know, winning this award for me, it would be really special because one, um, women, there's still so few women in tech, you know, not just in South Africa, but globally. Actually, according to um, a research that was done by McKenzie last year, only 36% only of women enter tech every year but only about 17% are in senior positions. And now, look at those stats and look specifically at women of color. Only 17% enter tech every year, but only 3% are in senior position. So I think for me, being one, being a woman, but also being a black woman, who's been doing some, you know, being successful in tech, I hope it will inspire a lot of other young women, you know, to aspire to enter in this industry, which where is currently male dominated, and women just you know don't feel like they belong i hope that if they can see me and say you know what she did it and um maybe i should pursue this it's, it's possible